product from farm and industrial waste developed by Sidlak Pinoy Incorporated is the reinforced fire bricks. Most of our dams, rivers, and waterways today have serious problems with siltation due to unabated soil erosion. Silt deposition drastically reduces the water holding capacities and the water conveying abilities of these waterways. Thus, rivers easily overflow during rainy seasons and dams easily dry up during short dry spells. These massive silt deposits should not remain as a menace. Rather, this ought to be turned into fire bricks. So the very mud that brought havoc to our people during typhoons can be the very source of affordable, durable, and beautiful housing materials for the flood victims. These alluvial silt deposits are excellent material for fire bricks. The process starts by mixing silt or ordinary soil with rice hull ash, fly ash, or bottom ash, or lahar, all waste materials. Add water and mix. The dough is then fed into the extruder. Then cut to sizes. Placed on pallets. Then air dried. The dried bricks are then fired using rice hull as fuel. The resulting rice hull ash is then used to prepare the next batch of bricks. There's nothing concrete hollow blocks can do that fire bricks can't do better and cheaper. Using reinforced fire bricks saves at least 50% on cement. It is five times stronger than concrete hollow blocks. It gives 40% savings on total construction cost. Reinforced fire bricks have very good refractory qualities. It is very ideal for making homes comfortable to live in. Reinforced fire bricks are naturally beautiful. There's no need to paint. They are fireproof and resistant to termites. Come to think of it, we can build low-cost but high-quality houses out of farm wastes. Mabuhay ang Pilipinas!